Hi, welcome to Lessons with John and the 24 days of Christmas. Uh, today we're going to try Blue Christmas on the Ook, okay? A uh, whole bunch of chords you're going to need for this one. We need a C chord, which is the first string, third fret. All right, G7 is the third string, second fret, second string, first fret, and then the first string, second fret. That's a G7 chord. D minor, we're going to need a uh, second string, first fret, and then your four and your three strings at the second fret. That's your G minor, uh, sorry, your D minor. Your G minor is your next chord. That's the first string, first fret, and then uh, third string, second fret, and then the second string, third fret. All right, that's a G minor. A7 is the uh, third string, first fret. Everybody else is open. Uh, D7 is the fourth string, second fret, second string, second fret, just like that. And then a really tough chord you're going to have, um, you might have issues with, uh, you have to practice it. Uh, fourth string, second fret, second string, second fret. And then I put my finger on the third string, third fret, and the first string, third fret. So all four fingers get to play. That's an F sharp diminished seven. Okay? And that sneaks up on you. That's going to come in, and it's just for a short moment. It's a passing chord. Diminished chords just pass between chords. It's a way of connecting things. Um, it's also like the Snidely Whiplash. You know, they did that in the movie theater. It's the, the thriller chord that the piano player would play back and forth. Um, okay, so Blue Christmas. Uh, our strum, we're just going to use our generic. Uh, we're in 4-4 four, four time. We're going to use our wagon wheel strum, if you remember that one. So it's down, down, up. Okay, so the problem with that one, down, down, up, you're up here, but your next one's an up, so you got to get your hand down to finish it off. So it's down, down, up, up, down, up, okay? Okay, you can do this like a, like a country type song, you know, a lot of the country singers do this one. Uh, you can do the Elvis one like this if you want. Um, uh, I love all of them, so uh, any one you want, but that's, that's the strum pattern, that's a pretty easy one. Uh, and we've done it in many songs, so you should be able to catch on to that eventually if you if you watch any of these videos. All right, so I'm going to have a blue Christmas. Here we go. Uh, we're going to start with a C. We're going to go to a G7, and then a D minor to a G7, back to a C chord. G minor sneaking up to an A7. To a D minor, D7, and then a G7 if you're not here with me, and I'll have a C chord. To a G7, and then a D minor, to a G7, and then a C chord. G minor to an A7. To a D minor, and then the F sharp diminished seven, and then the G seven, and then the C chord, and they can just repeat. Okay. All right. Any questions, comments down below? Uh, Merry Christmas. Please subscribe, and I hope you get a new ook for Christmas.